Aloha, and welcome to Betty's Real Estate Corner, brought to you by Roy and Betty Sakamoto, both here in the studio, Caldwell Banker at Kapalua. So here we are again, Roy, just kind of settling down, middle of the week, almost end of the week. Almost the end of the week. A lot of stuff going on and still. Know, um, I was just thinking, we're, we're kind of the... Uh, in our ideal dresses today. Yes, you, we are. <laughs> Betty's got a jacket on, kind of a almost like a suit. And uh, I'm in the studio in golf shirt, shorts, and slippers. Slippers, yes, <laughs> slippers. Yeah. It is. We didn't realize till we got in the car. And it is funny, though, because I moved here from Buffalo, New York, and then lived in Chicago for a while. But I've been here 47 years or something. But I still have that little part of me that if I'm going to be meeting certain clients or I'm meeting someone in the office, I really kind of like to dress up and look like it's a business deal. Now, for Roy, I think that if he puts on his golf shirt, shorts, and slippers, he is ready for a business deal. Yeah, absolutely. And it works for both of us. We both kind of smile when we look at one another in the car sometimes. <laughs> it's like we didn't see how we got yeah. dressed in the morning. <laughs> You know, it's been uh, today. We're we've got a whole bunch of different things. Dr. Eston's going to check in with us in about 15 minutes, I think. So that'll be fine. But good to hear from him again. Learn what's going on. We're, we've got a bunch of different properties that we're going to chat about, and maybe different market ideas. I brought with me a thing that I've read a couple of times over the years, but it's it's kind of more probably. De definitely more the same today than it was. This was originally in Farm and Land Realtor Magazine, October 1917. You remember this, don't you? Yeah, 1917. Well, not exactly the 1917 that was, Well, that part. was a good year, though. Yes. Yeah. Anyway, it's <laughs> called Procrastination. I hesitate to make a list of all the countless deals I've missed. Bonanzas that were in my grip, I watched through my fingers slip. The windfalls that I should have bought were lost because I overthought. I thought of this, I thought of that. I could have sworn I smelled a rat, and others grabbed them at that price. It seems I always hesitate, then make my mind up way too late. A very cautious man am I, and that is why I never buy. How Nassau and how Suffolk grew, New Jersey, Staten Island too, while others scold those sprawling farms and welcome deals with open arms. A corner here, 10 acres there, compounding value year by year. I chose to think, and as I thought, they bought the deals I should have bought. The golden chances I had then are lost and will not come again. Today I cannot be enticed for everything so overpriced. The deals of yesteryear are dead, the market's soft and so's my head. Last night I had a fearful dream. I know I wakened with a scream. Some Indians approached my bed for trinkets on the barrel head in dollar bills worth 24 and nothing less and nothing more. They'd sell Manhattan Isle to me. The most I'd go was 23. The Redmond scowled, not on a bet, and sold to Peter Menuet. At times, a teardrop drowns my eye for deals I had but did not buy. And now life's paddest, saddest words I pen, if only I'd invested then. We're seeing a lot of that right now. Yeah, you know, it's interesting. Um, 105 years ago, that was written. Uh, imagine that. Imagine that. And, and people are still using the same excuse or, you know, still coming up with, uh, God, I should have bought last year or I should have bought uh, four years ago, whatever. There's, um, for, for people like that, there's never a good time to buy. Uh, we've had people say, hey, I'm going to wait till the market bottoms out, and then I'll buy. And we've watched that enough. Oh, yeah. And, uh, you know, we've been in business a lot of years, and uh, we don't know when the market's at bottom. Now, the only way we know the market has bottomed is exactly what's in that article is that it's back up. Yeah. You know, and you think, oh, shoot, you know, I, sh I should have, should have, would have, could have. It's, uh, it's, it's an amazing article, 1917. So here we go again, where again, there's fewer listings than ever or for a long time, but there are people that are still buying. I still think if we all think about where we've seen interest rates in the past, the worst was around 19%. And people were buying real estate at the time. Yes, absolutely. I remember I sold a million dollar property to somebody at a time that things weren't selling like that. 
but it was a brand new home. The person that bought it really loved it. She could afford to do it. I was stunned when it really went through and she did that mortgage. But then in the end, she paid the mortgage off maybe a year and a half later, and the house turned out to be the deal that we all should have invested in. Absolutely. You remember we had the first million dollar listing in Ka'anapali? Yes. And uh, Hakui Loop. Yeah. And a lot of agents uh, in our business kind of laughed at us. You know, you're going to sell that house for a million dollars? Are you serious? And we sure did. Look at where the market has gone. Yeah. You can't buy anything less than two million now in Ka'anapali Hillside. Pretty much, you're right. I yeah. mean, let darn close to it. Right. Two million is almost just acceptable today. Interest rates are going up, but I still think, you know, if you look over the past 20 years, the interest rates are still pretty good. Very good. So, yeah, Absolutely. I, I totally agree. Absolutely. Prices obviously are up, but I'm just, it's not like there's been just a short surge in the market. I believe the market has totally changed. It could slip again, but we're not going to see it back 10 years. No. And you know what's interesting? Uh, people from out of the area, um, we'll, we'll call them visitors, are, are looking at Maui in particular and saying, wow, your, your deals are pretty good here. And we're seeing condominiums, uh, homes uh, being snapped up by these visitors who are looking at second homes or uh, perhaps eventually moving here to Maui. And uh, they can see the values in you know, in, in real estate here on Maui. And uh, a lot of our local residents can't. I, I totally agree with you. I mean, you're right. It is, uh, most of those properties are somewhat normal second home investor properties. You know, people are doing short-term rentals, the ones that are legal. I mean, I think it has cut out a whole, and now most of the people doing illegal rentals, I think are getting pushed out of that. And should be. And should be. I think it's time that everybody, the law is the law. Let's all be civic-minded. It's Let's do the right thing. But I think you're right. I mean, like sometimes now when somebody is looking to buy a home or a place to live in, if something's available, take a good, long, hard look at it because it's going to be, for a long time, better than rent. And with the current interest rates, if you can find something that works for you and your family, uh, give it some thought. I mean, talk to a lender. Get together with your real estate agent. Yeah, you know, it's your <clears throat> your first step should be contact a realtor. Whether you're looking for a primary residence, a second home, an investment property, whatever, start with a realtor who's familiar with the market, uh, can help guide you to the right lenders, the right uh, escrow company, the right professionals. Um, including, you know, home inspectors and so forth. So start with the realtor. Uh, you can start by calling Roy or Betty. Uh, my number is 808-870-7060. Betty is 808-870-7062. Call us. You know, if we can't help you directly, we can certainly point you in the right direction or uh, help you find a, a realtor that can help you. So um, call us. We have a great office. We're, at, we're located right now at Kapalua. We can have you stop by and chat with us. If it's something that we aren't as attached to or we're not as knowledgeable about, there, about there's someone in our office that is, and we can have you talk with someone. Uh, we've, uh, Ethan Kaliopu has been here with me a number of different days, and he's fabulous, and he's worked a lot with local residents. He's really... I'd say fairly expert today at helping people get loans and work toward getting qualified also. Very much so. Right. Yeah. He's really, really great. Yeah. Lahaina Luna graduate and um, worked with Roy when he was still in high school. He was interning for us. And he was, it was amazing. He would do anything. And that's how we always operated over the years. If you had to clean the lanai or race through a house and pick it up as fast as you could or hide all the dirty laundry, we all know how to do that. Yeah, we certainly Ethan, do. Yeah, Ethan's uh, interesting. He called uh, during his senior year. He's looking for a senior class project, and he wanted to learn about real estate. So he called and um, asked if he could learn about real estate under us. And so I asked him to come into our office then. And uh, so he came in in a couple of days. We sat and talked. 
And I asked him, why would you want to go into real estate? And uh, I'll never forget his, his answer. I thought he was going to come back and say, well, I want to make uh, boatloads of money, um, buy two cars, buy homes here, buy homes there, and so forth. His answer was, I want to help people make, uh, make a decision and find the right property. And, you know, that stuck with me. That's, um, that's Ethan, who has um, kind of been kind of our underling, I, I would say. He's grown a lot under us and uh, hopefully has learned a he lot. He may have us. been an underling. No. He's, he's knocking it dead right oh, now. Yeah, he no. is. He's fabulous. No, no. He's the he's, sweetest, good, nice yeah, guy. He's sword and uh, so happy for him. I am. He's, he can be reached at 808 868 8123, I think is the best number for Ethan. Right. 808 868 8123. And he really is a great one for a first time home buyer. Or his dad has worked at Kapalua forever and is an amazing person. So he knows Kapalua. He knows Kanapali. He grew up. He grew up. He's Lahaina Luna boy and uh, really great. Local boy. Local yeah. boy. Yeah. So, so call, yeah, call Ethan. Uh, what was Ethan's number again? 808-868-8123. Ethan Kaleopu. Uh, he's with Kobo Banker, Kapalua. Uh, and again, call us, Roy, at 808-870-7060. Or Betty, yeah. 808-870-7062. And we'll you know, direct you in any way we can, help you with anything, find a great property for you. It, um, it's a hard time, but I think that properties are available and uh, it's, it's never too late. Exactly. So, yeah. yeah. We should hear from Norm shortly, but I think we could take a look. Do you want to see if any of those properties that we brought along with us, we might want to share some information on? Yeah. Here's a condominium, a one-bedroom, one-bath condominium at Kulakani. In, um, in Hanakawai, in West Maui. Uh, one bedroom, one bath. Apartment number is 108, so it's a ground floor unit. Listed at 600,000 by Ray Chin from our office. Ray can be reached at 808-344-2677. And we repeat numbers uh, quite fast, so uh, just kind of remember Roy or Betty Sakamoto. Yeah, if you take down our numbers, you'll be... We'll get you to everybody. Yeah, absolutely. Here's another one, Roy. Channel House in Lahaina, Unit A204, listed at 385000 It's leasehold, but really fabulous location for anybody, easy place to live, and uh, listed by George Nunes, also a Lahaina Luna graduate. He can be reached at 808-385-385. 4665 or Lena Taberna at 808 281 4240. Really great. One bedroom, one bath. You're right there across from the water in Lahaina. You can get everywhere. It's a perfect spot to have a second home or rent it long term. And I think that it's a great, great location. Really nice shape, also. Or to live in. Yeah, yeah, or to live absolutely. in, I think, perfect. Yeah, what a great price. We would have loved that at one time. Yeah, yep. sure. It was perfect. Now, here's a Pohailani uh, unit. It's a two-bedroom. Uh, unit number is 219. It's listed by Elizabeth Quayle from our office. Uh, listed at 697000 which is a great price for a two-bedroom. It's at Pohailani and Kahana. Uh, Elizabeth can be reached at 808 808- Two seven six six zero six one, and this is for Pohailani number two one nine. You know another listing that we have right now at Kapalua is Nine Bay Drive, and we haven't ever talked about it on the radio, and it is directed more at the very top top of the market. But if someone you know check in with Roy, he's been tied to the owner, and it's a spectacular home between the Montage and the Kapalua Bay Villas on acreage, it is really unbelievable. It's, yeah, it's just under 10 acres of, of land. Uh, a good portion of it is under a conservation easement to the Hawaii Island Land Trust. 
and it's for the protection of the Hawaiian seabird. Uh, and actually, they're starting to nest as we speak right now. And uh, soon we'll have these little hatchlings, little birds. Uh, it's, it's so sweet. Yeah. They're little white fluff balls, and uh, it's great to, to see these birds um, uh, take flight. It's uh, a part of this, a good part of this 10 acres is, uh, is the nesting ground for the Hawaiian seabird. You know, another great thing there, they put in a lot of uh, fruit trees. Almost mm-hmm. every fruit that you can think of that can grow in Hawaii is growing on that property. And it's, it's really one of the sweetest, most wonderful places that I've ever been. Yeah, it's uh, six bedrooms, seven baths around a central courtyard. Uh, I think the home itself is about 6,000, 6,500 square feet, something like that. A couple of extra small bathrooms. Yeah, <laughs> and uh, with, the, um, uh, with the courtyard, there's really about uh, 10, 11,000 square feet that you're working with as, as your residence. It's all interior space, really. Right. You know, you come through, a, it's very safe, it's interior space, you're, you'll be living in that courtyard a good deal of the time. Oh, yeah. And uh, it's zoned, a um, good portion of the property is zoned conservation. So uh, for those of you looking to vacation rent a, a property, this is not it. Uh, you'll never be able to vacation rent, which is great. It should be that way. You can always have your guests stay next door at the Montage or on the other side at the Kapalua Bay Villas, at the Ritz-Carlton at Kapalua. But it is that one special property. Uh, we obviously aren't showing it that often because there's a limited number of buyers. But I just thought it was time that we mentioned that on the radio because everybody listens to the radio, yep. I think. We've, we have it listed at 59500000 million five hundred thousand. Uh, we've had some very, very interesting showings, and um, I think uh, we've there's a buyer already that's seen it, uh, but it's still available right now. And so call us. Call Roy at 808-870-7060 or Betty at 808-870-7062 and ask us uh, for more info on Nine Bay Drive. Good. That'll be a fun one. Yeah. It'll be great. You know, here's one other listing, Roy, and maybe even the specific unit doesn't matter, but it is, there is a listing, one bedroom, one bath at the Maui El Dorado, which is one of the oldest condominiums, more or less, I'd say, in West Maui. It ca- connects to the water by way of the Kanapali Golf Course, but they have a great cabana that belongs to them on right down sitting on the beach that I'm not so sure if that ever gets taken out by a wave or something, you're going to build it again. But it really is one of the greatest places. Anytime you're walking along the beach there and you see that cabana, it's the place you'd like to be hanging out. But the Maui El Dorado, beautiful rooms, beautiful location. You can walk everywhere in the resort. There's a beach there. You can get down to the other side, Kanapali Beach, in front of the Sheraton. Uh, Maui El Dorado. Whaler's um, Village. Right there, yeah. Yeah. Anyway, perfect spot. Here's a, here's a great one at Kahana Reef, and uh, this is listed by Dave Quant. Uh, Dave's number is 808-457-0604, and hopefully Dave's listening. Uh, I think he listens to our program quite a bit. Anyway, this is uh, one bedroom, one bath. Apartment number is 411, and it's listed at 895, 895000 for a one bedroom, one bath, Kahana Red, uh, Reef, right on the ocean, and David Quant is the listing agent. Okay, good news. We have Dr. Esten on the phone. We're going to be coming up to the end of the show, and we'll get to have Danny Couch again. But right now, we've got Dr. Norm Esten, doctors on call from Kapalua to Wailea. Dr. Esten. Hey, aloha, Betty and Roy. Um, gorgeous day here in paradise. Uh, As usual, water is clear as ever. Full moon is uh, giving us uh, big tides, uh, low lows, high highs, and it's just gorgeous. Uh, And it's it's a wonderful place to be. Um, In terms of COVID, we're doing great. Uh, Very few, uh, very sick people. But uh, things aren't perfect. 
There are three places in the country that have lots of cases, lots of L-O-T-S-A, like we say in Hawaii, lots of cases, and they are Puerto Rico, Florida, and Hawaii. And we're in the top three because we have so many visitors coming in on planes still bringing us COVID. So even though we're not really sick in the hospital, we've got big numbers. So the warning for all of us who live here is, one, if you haven't been vaccinated or boosted yet, go and get it because it will prevent you from getting real sick or winding up in a hospital or worse. And all the vaccinations are free at any pharmacy or your doctor's office. And secondly, if you are indoors still with a big crowd, especially strangers, it's wise to mask up. And if you're at all compromised in terms of your ability to fight off infections or uh, getting older, then you want to mask up indoors for sure. Now, going forward, uh, this probably isn't going to go away. About five months ago, I said, hey, we had Omicron. Everybody's going to get it, but nobody's going to be real sick. That's exactly what happened. January, February, and March, everybody got sick with a little sinus infection. Two months ago, I told you, hey, Elvis has left the building, but the COVID has not. And that's exactly what it was. We still had the COVID around. And now the news I have for you is it's not going away. It's always going to be with us. And that's why we have to be especially protective and not let our guard down. So, again, indoor masking, vaccination and boosted if you haven't yet. And the reason is you don't want to get this because of the risk of long COVID. That's where you have symptoms that last for years and years and years, affecting your heart, your lungs, or your nervous system and your brain. And we do not have a test for that yet. Hey, Norm, we have hit the two-minute warning, so we're going to have to say that that's the end of our notice to everyone, but I think it's got to be taken as that. It's a serious notice. If you haven't been vaccinated, get vaccinated. Go to doctors on call. Call first. But, you know, see, you know, go there to get vaccinated or wherever else they're doing vaccinations at this point. Do it. Get boosted. Make it all happen because otherwise no one's protected. You know, if each of us doesn't take care of the other, Someone else is going to have it, and someone else. That's right. And, and wear your mask, as Dr. Norm just said. Uh, anytime you're indoors, when you're on an airplane, a lot of us are traveling this summer. I think the grocery store. Keep a, keep a mask on. Grocery and, store. Anywhere any, indoors, yeah. Any place, no matter where you go. I mean, even if you're walking into doctors on call, put your mask on. You know, it's not going to hurt us until we sit down and are trying to talk or something. But let's do it. If you go to a movie... God forbid wear a mask, you know, wherever you are today. If you look around and you're going to be close to people, let's mask. Let's do it. It's not that hard. No, very easy. Very easy. So we are again. I don't know if Norm has quite hung up yet, but I think we are. He did. Okay. Thank you, Norm, so much. You can reach doctors on call at 808-667-7676. And uh, I think we are here now. Danny Couch is back with us. So aloha to you. And hello, Danny Couch. Aloha. 